November 16, 2014 from Qualcomm Stadium in San Diego, California. It was the Oakland Raiders at the San Diego Chargers in this AFC West Division rivalry game. The Chargers won the toss and they elected to defer so the Raiders would get the ball first and on the first play from scrimmage, Derek Carr fumbled and it was recovered by the Chargers. So now the Chargers would have the ball and it would be on their own 22. And on 2nd and 10 from the 22, Phillip Rivers dropped back to pass and he hit Malcolm Floyd for a 22-yard touchdown. And it was now 7-0 San Diego over Oakland after just three plays from scrimmage. The second play from scrimmage for the Chargers. And so now the Raiders would get the ball back and they would start off on their own 19-yard for their second possession. Down by a touchdown with less than a minute off the clock. They would go three and out, and they'd punt the ball to the San Diego Chargers, and the Chargers would also go three and out, and they would punt it right back to the Raiders. So now the Raiders had the ball with about 11 minutes left in the first. They had it on their own 30. They were faced with a third and eight from the 32, and Derek Carr hit Andre Holmes for a nine-yard pass that made it a first down on the 41. Derek Carr then hit Rivera for a 33-yard pass, and that made it a first down on the San Diego 26. Their drive would stall on the 23, and they'd bring out Sebastian Janikowski to attempt a 42-yard field goal. It was up. It was good. And the Raiders were on the scoreboard. And the score was now San Diego 7, Oakland 3, as the Raiders trailed by 4. So now with 7.5 minutes left in the first, the Chargers would take over on their own 20 after the kickoff. And they would end up getting the ball up towards midfield. And then they stalled, though, on the Oakland 45, and they would punt the ball. And so now Oakland would take over in the shadow of their own end zone on their own six-yard line with about two minutes left in the first quarter, and they would go three and out. So now the Chargers would get the ball back on their own 41 with less than a minute left before the end of the first quarter. And then... On 2nd and 10 from the 44, an incomplete pass. The second incomplete pass in a row would bring the first quarter to a close with the score San Diego 7, Oakland 3. So now to start things off in the second quarter was 3rd and 10 on the Oakland 44. Rivers dropped back and hit Floyd for a 3-yard pass, but that would bring out the punting unit. And so now Oakland would take over once again in the shadow of their end zone, this time on their own 4-yard line with about 14 minutes left in the second quarter. They would go 3 and out yet again and punt the ball back to the Chargers who now got the ball with about 13 minutes left on the clock before halftime. They had it on their own 46. They picked up a first down but then they would end up punting it from their own 49 after a penalty brought them backwards. So now Oakland would get the ball back and they went three and out for the once again. They got sacked on first down. Connor got a sack. It was only for a one yard loss but that was about all they needed is they would end up, like I said, forcing the three and out. The Chargers now had the ball with about nine and a half minutes left in the second quarter. They had it near midfield at their own 43. On second and nine, Rivers hit Gates for a 12-yard pass to make it a first down on the 44. Then Rivers went to Royal for a 13-yard pass, and they made it a first down on the 31. Ryan Matthews then ran for eight yards, and then he ran for three yards, and then he ran for seven yards. And now it was second and three on the Oakland 13 as they were in the red zone. They then switched it up going to Oliver, who ran for four yards, then four yards, and then got stopped for no gain. And that brought up third and five from the five. And so now Phillip Rivers to an incomplete pass, and out would come Nick Novak to attempt a 23-yard field goal. It was up. It was good. And the Chargers were now up by seven points with the score, San Diego 10, Oakland 3. So now the, Char the Raiders would get the ball on their own 20 with about four minutes left before halftime. They'd pick up a first down with a 15-yard pass from Carr to Butler, and now it was on the 35 of Oakland. A five-yard run by McFadden would make it second and five. And a four-yard pass from Carr to Lineart would make it third and one. But no game would bring out the punting unit. Uh, and so fourth and one from the 44, they punted the ball back to the Chargers. So the Chargers would take over on their own 23 with about two minutes left. A little less than two minutes left before halftime. They would end up getting into Oakland territory all the way down to the 30. It was actually a first down on the 30, but with only a couple seconds left, Nick Novak would come out to attempt the field goal. And so it was a 48-yarder, and it was up, and it was no good. 
And so the score remained 10-3 as this game went to halftime. So the Chargers were up over the Raiders by a touchdown. And so starting things off in the third quarter with San Diego up with a score of San Diego 10, Oakland 3, just to be clear. The Chargers would take over first in the third, start off the second half, and they would go 3 and out. The Raiders would also go 3 and out on their first possession of the second half. And so now the San Diego Chargers would take over on their own 33 with about 11 and a half minutes left in the third quarter. And they would be faced with a third and five from the 38. And a penalty, a neutral zone infraction against Oakland would make it a first down on the San Diego 43. Ryan Matthews then ran for 20 yards to make it a first down and bring the ball across midfield and into Oakland territory at the 37. They were then faced with the third and four, and a penalty of offensive holding would make it third and 14. They failed to pick up the first down. They did pick up seven with a pass to Keenan Allen from Rivers, but out would come Nick Novak to attempt a 52-yard field goal. It was up, and it was good. And so now the score was 13-3 as the Chargers extended their lead to 10 points. So now the Raiders would take over with over seven minutes left in the third. They were backed up against their own end zone, as was a motif in this game. They are on their own eight-yard line to start the drive. They'd actually pick up 19 yards, but then uh, offensive pass interference would negate it. And now it would be first and 14 from their own four, and they would end up punting the ball from the three. And so now the Chargers with the ball, but they would go three and out and punt it right back to the Raiders, who now took over with about three and a half minutes left in the third. Yet again, backed up against their own end zone, this time on their two-yard line. And they would end up picking up a first down, though, on third and five from the seven when Derek Carr hit Jones for a seven-yard pass to bring it out to the 14. And then on second and 10 from the 14, Murray ran for 14 yards to bring it out to the 28. And then on first down from the 28, Murray ran for 23 yards. So now the ball was up at midfield on the San Diego 49, and McVannon ran for five, and that brought the third quarter to a close. So after three quarters of play, the score was San Diego 13, Oakland 3. And to begin the fourth quarter, it was second and five on the 44 for the Raiders. And an incomplete pass, two incomplete passes, would bring out the punting unit. And so now the Chargers would take over. This time they were backed up against their own end zone on their own one-yard line. And they would end up getting out of the shadow of their end zone. And they would end up getting the ball out towards the 24, but they would end up hunting it from there. And so now the Raiders would take over with about 11 minutes left in the game. They had it on their own 26. They picked up a first down on first down with a 10-yard pass from Carr to Holmes. That brought it out to the 36. But then on third and seven, Carr threw an incomplete pass, and there was a penalty of holding against the offense. But there was also an illegal contact against the defense, and the penalties offsetted. And so out would come the punting unit, and the Chargers would take back over with eight minutes left in this game. They had it on their own 13, but they went three and out as Phillip Rivers was sacked by Mack on third down for a five-yard loss. So now the Raiders would take over after the punt with about six minutes left in the game, trailing by 10 points. They headed on their own 45, and on third and five from the 50, Derek Carr hit Tompkins for a 35-yard pass that would make it a first down in the red zone at the San Diego 15. They would end up stalling, though, on the seven-yard line, and they would bring out Janikowski to attempt a 25-yard field goal. It was up, it was good, and it was now 13-6 San Diego over Oakland as the Raiders cut the Chargers' lead to seven points. So now with four minutes left in the game, the Chargers would get the ball on their own 20. They'd pick up a first down with a pass from Rivers to Allen for 13 yards. Then on first and 10 from the 33, Matthews ran for eight yards to make it second and two on the 41. He then lost a yard. Oakland took a timeout. And so now it was third and three on the 40. And Rivers went to Gates and he picked up 15 yards in the first down. Oakland was forced now to burn their second timeout. Now it's first and 10 on the 45 for the Chargers. And Matthews got stopped for no gain. And so now the Raiders took their third timeout. Now it's second and 10 from the 45. And Brandon Oliver ran for five yards. And this game went to the two minute warning. So now it's third and five on the Oakland 40, and they hand it off to Brown. He got stopped for no gain, and it would be the Chargers who would actually take a timeout. And then they would end up, after the timeout, still getting a delay of game, 
and they would punt the ball now with a minute on the clock. And so now they'd punt it, and the Raiders would take over on their own 12-yard line. So the Raiders had one minute on the clock, a buck five, and they needed a touchdown to tie it and send it into overtime. First down from the Raiders, 12, and on first down, Derek Carr drops back to pass, and he was sacked for a nine-yard loss by Adacho. And so now it was second and 19 from the three. Carr then hit Murray for a 10-yard pass, and that made a third and nine from the 13, and an incomplete pass would bring up fourth down. It was fourth and nine from the 13. Derek Carr drops back to pass, and he found Jones for a 28-yard reception. It was now first down on the 41. Derek Carr rushed up to the line, and he spiked the ball. Now it was second and 10 from the 41. 11 seconds left on the clock. He dropped back. He was running around, running around, looking for somebody. He threw it up. Oh, and it was incomplete. And the game comes to a close. And the San Diego Chargers hold on to beat the Raiders. The Raiders made it interesting, but they still remain winless. As the Raiders are now 0-9 on the season. San Diego improves to 6-4. They're 4-1 at home. As I said, the Raiders are 0-10 on the season as they remain winless. In this game, Phillip Rivers was 22 for 34 with 193 yards passing and a touchdown. Derek Carr was 16 for 34 with 172 yards passing. The leading rusher in the game was Ryan Matthews with 70 yards off of 16 carries. The leading receiver was Keenan Allen with 63 yards off of 8 receptions. The leading tackler in this game was Charles Woodson from the University of Michigan playing for the Oakland Raiders. The veteran, the future Hall of Famer, 14 tackles in this game. The leading tackler for San Diego was Cavell Connor with nine tackles. He also had a sack, one of two sacks for San Diego. The other one was Adacho, Adachu, excuse me. <laughs> And uh, the Raiders had two sacks. Khalil Mack had a sack. And also Antonio Smith had a sack. And there were no interceptions in the game. But quite an exciting game. Very low scoring. It was all defense. The Raiders made it interesting. But San Diego holds on to win in the final score. Chargers 13, Raiders 6.